What's up guys, Velo here. Uh, this is a high ground retake that I was working on earlier today. And uh, I saw this actually on YouTube. I can't take credit for that, but I do really like uh, the way it works. I think it's very simple. It's definitely something that's good for high ping players. And it might not look simple, but I assure you if you're an average to above average player, you can learn this, right? So we're gonna start how many high ground retakes start, running up a single stair. Um, what you're gonna do, you know, you can look up here, you can look here, doesn't matter, but you're just gonna place a cone and then a floor, right? This is how a lot of high ground retakes start. Um, you can do this to the right or the left, but we're gonna start by showing you on the right hand side. Uh, once you get to this point, what you're gonna do is edit the floor, these two tiles, and then edit these two tiles of the cone. And I like doing it, both edits going down, but uh, the person I actually watched do it the first time, they edited the floor and then the cone up so that the crosshair was already up. Um, that's probably the best way to learn it. However, I've done this edit so many times on uh, other high ground retakes that I'm just so used to doing it. And I'm on keyboard and mouse, which I think makes that maneuver a little bit easier. I think if you're on uh, controller, editing down and then up would be, uh, would be easier. I don't know, you guys tell me. So anyway, once you get to this part, you got the floor and the cone up there. Edit the floor, edit the cone. You want to get your crosshair on that cone because we're gonna be placing a cone above it. So you pull out your cone and while holding turbo build, right? You have your cone there. You're just gonna do a 180 degree turn while looking up. So it's placing four cones, right? Four cones. And then at this point, you know, we're running up like this. Got our four cones. You're gonna pull out your walls and you're gonna build the wall there, there, and there. And as this is happening, it's gonna happen really fast. You'll see here in a minute. You wanna make sure that you finish with your crosshair on the wall and not the cone. And I'm gonna show you why, because we're gonna land on a stair. Okay, so when these walls come out, we're jumping in the air and we're placing our stair. If my crosshair is on the cone, that wall, I mean, sorry, that stair is not gonna place and you're just gonna fall, right? So make sure your crosshair is there and you're landing on the ramp, okay? So again, I'm gonna keep going slow here. Cone floor, edit the floor, edit the cone, look up, 180 degree turn. And then from here, you're not, you don't have to stop building. All you're doing is switching to walls and you're turning. And at this point you're already jumping, right? We're doing this slowly. Crosshairs on the wall, land on the ramp. Okay, we'll do it a little bit faster. Edit, edit, cone, 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 wall, wall, ramp. Okay, so you see the, these cones out here are providing uh, additional cover. It's also uh, just putting a lot of material out there so that it's harder for your opponent to track you. And from here, you have a few options and I, without going crazy and showing you guys other retakes, you know, you can edit out forward, uh, you can edit out to the side, you can do a side jump. There's a number of things that you can do from this situation, but we'll do it at full speed. And that's what it looks like right there. Going to the left, it would look like this. Cone floor, edit the floor, edit the cone. Look up, crosshair placement has to be up on that edited cone. 180 degree turn to the left. And now you're basically just making a 90 degree turn now to the right and make sure your crosshair is on that wall when you place that ramp. And I highly, highly encourage you guys to start this really slow. You know, if you don't traditionally do this double edit, you know, work on that. And then this movement, it's gonna feel really nice, especially if you're on keyboard and mouse, cause it's just swipe to the right, switch to the wall, swipe to the left, and then you land on that ramp, okay? And that's what it looks like full speed. And let's see if I can do it. I don't know if I can do it to the left. I haven't really practiced it a whole lot. It's really not that difficult of a high ground retake. Again, it looks like it, but it's really not. See, that's what happens right there if you don't have the crosshair on the wall. And that's a great example. This has been my struggle because I'm anticipating this edit, right? I'm anticipating jumping and landing on this ramp in this edit editing the cone. So my crosshair in that situation was actually on the cone and that's why my uh, ramp didn't place. So what I did just to show you guys, I got to here and I was already looking up when I jumped and noticed that when I'm looking up, that ramp is not gonna place, okay? I hope that makes sense. I hope this was helpful. Uh, let me know if you guys try it. Let me know if you guys use it. I'm definitely gonna be using this a lot more frequently uh, in my retakes, just because especially on high ping, I think this is a great retake for high ping players. So anyway, guys, have a good day.